Hi, I'm Charlotte Voisey and I'm going to make you a twist on the Negroni. The Negroni is a classic Italian aperitif dating back to the 1930s in Florence. And there are many modern day variations on this classic combination of gin, campari and sweet vermouth. I'm going to make my unusual Negroni using Hendrix Gin as a base, which is a lighter style gin that demands lighter style companions in its cocktail. So instead of Campari, we're going to use Aperol, a little lighter, not quite as aggressive, easier on the Hendrix. And then rather than using a typical Italian sweet vermouth, I'm going to use something that's still sweet in flavor profile, uh, Lille Blanc. So equal parts, I'm sticking to those ratios. Here we go. Now, classically, the Negroni would be served on the rocks, given a little stir, or prepared like a classic martini in a mixing glass and stirred. Not today. I am going to throw my Negroni at you. What we're going to do is use an old European technique that I first saw in Barcelona. We're going to pour our cocktail into the tin, and using a julep strainer to keep the ice back, I am going to throw from shaker to glass, the Negroni, four or five times. And this is a technique called throwing that aerates the cocktail at the same time as cooling it down, mixing the ingredients, all the things we use shaking and stirring for. So you don't lose any of that beautiful mouthfeel of the gin. We don't bruise the gin like we do when we shake. And rather than just stirring, Throwing allows that aeration. It just opens up the flavor profiles. It gives it a nice, beautiful flavor. And quite frankly, it's kind of cool to watch. I remember going to this little bar called Boadas in Barcelona, just at the top of the Ramblas. And this big old fat guy would take this great big galone, a European mixing style glass. He would fill it up with the Negronis for five, six people. And he would toss them, throw them from shake it to glass in the bar and it was just a wonderful thing to watch. You can see probably that the shaker tin is starting to get cold so we're doing our job, we're mixing the cocktail properly and that'll probably be enough. Just discard my ice here and there you have an unusual Negroni thrown the European way. Finish up, we'll just use a little piece of orange peel to bring out those beautiful flavors in the Lillet. As we know, this gives us the aromatics from the essential oils of the citrus, right on top. So there you have your unusual Negroni. Cheers.